Hey YouTube, the Super CDAC here, and uh, I've been using LDD lately. Yep, LDD 4.3. It's got all the new bricks on it, all the new layout, so it's pretty cool. And I decided, hey, I think I'm gonna build something video game related again. I've only done two things that are video game related on my channel, unless you count the um, the tutorials on glitches and stuff on L, uh, Lego Batman. Well, you know, whatever. Um, yeah, this, as you can clearly see, is the Wii U gamepad. There it is in all its glory. Oh, you can't see it very well. Only thing about LDD is the lighting is crap. So, you know, I've got to improvise. There you go, it's all the buttons. you got two analog sticks. In fact, I'm going to give you a side-by-side -side comparison. See, you got the four-button array, the D-pad. you got plus, minus, or start and select. Power button, TV control, home, you know. You got all the headphone jacks and all, but I couldn't fit that in really. And you got this weird thing here, I've forgotten what it is. But, you know. I don't know if it's an actual button or anything, or whether it's just a marking, because I put it in here, as you can see. Probably isn't supposed to be like that, but oh well. You know. Okay. See if we can try and take a look at the back without LDD screwing itself over. So, usually here, if I just control click. Oh, that's a bit too much. Hang on. Usually, just here, there'll be an L button. Well, be R here, and on the other side of BL. Uh, um, so ZR, ZL, obviously. Those are the trigger buttons, and the shoulder buttons. So yeah, got obviously I've got the nice curvature around here. Big screen in the middle, because that's what the Wii U gamepad is basically for. A big screen in the middle, so you have two screens. If you ask me, it's not very revolutionary, because the DS did that first, but oh well. They do it in a kind of different way. You've got to watch the tour video to know about it. The tour of the Wii U gamepad, but you know. So yeah, you've got the camera up here. Uh, it's a pretty smooth model, I've got it all smooth tile, so no bumpy bits. I tried to make it look as much like the original as possible, because some Wii U gamepads made out of Lego on YouTube are really weird. They are really weird. Um, some of them are really square and have a giant screen, then sometimes there isn't even a D-pad. But you know, there you go. So uh, yeah, that's the Wii U gamepad.